how to get donation buttons, and please donate. Welcome to another Gaging Gadgets Roblox Please Donate tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get donation buttons on your booth in Please Donate. And I'll be showing you the easiest method that does not require you to pay any Robux to do this. And if this video helps you, please consider giving it a like and also subscribing to my channel because that really helps me out. All right, so to get started, the first thing we need to do is close Roblox on our computer if we currently have it open. Then you want to open up a browser and navigate to roblox.com and log into your account. Check the description. I'll have a direct link down there. Once you get logged into roblox.com, go up into the top menu and select create. And then once we get to the dashboard here under the experience tab and creations, all we need to do is go below and you should have a place here by default. All Roblox users have a place. So go ahead and select your place. And then in the left menu under details, we just want to find and select associated items. Once you get to associated items, select passes. So in order for us to actually have a donation button and please donate, we need to create either a shirt or a game pass. Now listing a shirt for sale will cost some Robux. So in order to do this for free, we need to create a game pass and it's really easy. So once we're under passes right here, simply find and select create a pass. And then the first thing we need to do is select upload image. So this is going to be the image for the game pass on our booth. So go ahead and select upload image, find an image on your computer. It can be any image, but keep in mind this will be displayed on your booth and please donate and Roblox moderators will have to approve it. So go ahead and select any image. After you select an image, come up with a name and keep in mind this name will also be displayed on your booth and please donate. After that, you can give it a description, but you don't have to. And then just go to the bottom and select create pass. Once you do that, it'll bring you back to your game passes here. And all we need to do is find and select the game pass we just created. You may not see the image that you uploaded simply because it does have to be approved by Roblox. So just give that some time to show up. Go ahead and select the game pass we just created. Once we do that, Go over to the left sidebar under details and select sales. So now in order for this button to show up on our donation booth in please donate, we need to first toggle item for sale and then give it a price. And this is how much we want to be donated to us in please donate. Now keep in mind that you'll only get 70% of that amount because Roblox keeps 30% of it. So if I list it for 10 Robux, I'm only going to get seven Robux when someone donates to me through that button. So once you set your price, go ahead and select save changes. And now we can go back to our associated items here and under passes, we can see that the game pass we just created now has 10 Robux under it. So now simply open up Roblox on your computer and then start, please donate. And then all we need to do is walk up to an empty booth, an unclaimed booth. Once you see stand right here, claim, hold E on your keyboard. This will claim it. And then you'll now see the donation button that you just created show up automatically. If you want to edit the text up here, all you need to do is go over to the left menu over here, select edit booth, and then type the text that you want to show up and select apply. As you can see, that'll update the text. Now we have a donation button on our stand and please donate, and we can start getting donations. All right, so that's how you get a donation button on your stand and please donate. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up. And please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.